Hey guys, it's me Clarice, uh, CNK Macla for the rest of you. I am here to do a quick vlog video about the cheese, the grilled cheese truck. <laughs> um, my sister and I decided to go to the grilled cheese truck tonight. Uh, this is like my first real food truck experience, so I figured, you know, why not try it? Um, I love grilled cheese, and hey, see what's up about it. So you're thinking usually grilled cheese, you can totally make that at home, but these people have like won awards, and they're, you know, they were featured on the Food Network, I believe, and um, they just have been like really highly acclaimed, like the the raves, all the raves about this truck are like serious. So we decided to go. We went while they're in Culver City because that's really close to where my sister um, lives. And we got there. I'm looking at the fly right now. Sorry. Um, we got there and it was like so many people in line. Like it was pretty ridiculous. And I was like, really? It's, a, it's like it's grilled cheese. Like, come on now. Like, why are you guys waiting in line for a food truck? This is, come on, this is ridiculous. And especially since tonight it was like 50 degrees, which for LA is freakishly cold. <laughs> And it has a wind chill factor, so it probably lowered it down to like 45 with the wind. Um, so yeah, LA, that's like frequently cold because we don't have cold weather out here really. Um, you know, living in California. So, we get in line and well, you know, well, be rewind. So while we're at my sister's house, she's on the uh, menu on her iPhone and she's... Showing me the menu, she's telling me that, you know, what she's going to get, and she's, I'm looking through the menu, and I decided to get the, uh, what is it called, the, the Bayou Melt, and she decides to get the Brie Melt. So I'm going to go ahead and bust this out for you and tell you what's on it. So this is what the menu looks like. Um, it's a little wrinkled and because I folded it up and put it in my pocket and stuff, but hey, whatever. Okay, so the Bayou Melt, which is what I had, is grilled with Tabasco and thyme butter and it has habanero jack cheese chicken and dooley sausage with sausage uh, with sauteed peppers and onions and let me tell you if you like spicy food it's like totally the thing for you because it's got the right amount of spice to it and it's really good the chicken and dooley sausage is like uber spicy so yeah, I, it's 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 a pretty good sandwich. Um, not your typical grilled cheese, but it's super melty and really tasty. Oh, and then we got the jalapeno crusted bread, which has slices of jalapeno inside the crust of the bread. So that was like banana. So it adds a little extra element. Um, and you have a nice you have a nice balance with the sautéed onions because there's red and green onions in there, and um, you know, they're a little more sweet, so you have a sweet with the spicy, so you have a nice combination. And now my sister, she got the brie melt, and that is on a black pepper potato bread. And it comes with double cream brie, double cream brie cheese with smoked pork loin, peach preserves, and fresh thyme. And I did try a bite of hers, and it is, like, super good. Like, brie, for me, is, like, a really great cheese. I love brie cheese anyway, so I, w I was tempted to get this, but I wanted to do something, like, she gets something, I get something different. Um, so it was definitely good, but I think with the peach preserves that it made it a little bit sweet for me at the, at the same time. Like, there wasn't enough, it wasn't really balanced for my liking, but she was like raving about it. She loves it. So, um, yeah. We also got a dessert melt. Now for the dessert melts, okay, they have um they come on a sweet brioche bun and or bread, sorry. And they have a s'more melt and a mascarpone melt. Now the mascarpone has it's vanilla mascarpone with fresh seasonal fruit and vanilla wafers, which anybody who loves vanilla wafers, like you're gonna love this because vanilla wafers are the bomb. Um, and what we ordered, we tried these s'more because you really can't go wrong with s'mores because, hello, it's, like, the best all-American dessert. Um, so, yeah, so that came with marshmallow cream, Nutella, and crumbled graham crackers on the brioche spread. And it's, like, uber delicious. It's so freaking good. Like, so freaking good. I can't even, like, I can't even tell you how good this is. And 
it was actually almost a little too sweet for me. And I really like my sweets, but it was actually a little too sweet for me. Like, we didn't even finish it. Um, so, hey. Uh, as far as servings, it's a little bit bigger than your typical grilled cheese sandwich. So, you're gonna, you're gonna get full off of this. It's not like a little knick-knack patty whack thing. Oh, and the other, um, cheese melts they have, I'm going to tell you that. They have a cheesy mac melt on French bread with macaroni and cheese with sharp cheddar. And then they have their signature melt, which is cheesy mac and ribs. And, um, it says, a.k.a. the fully loaded. And that has smoked barbecue pork and caramelized onions with sharp cheddar. And you can totally do, like, a plain, regular, like, grilled cheese sandwich. Because they have, like, just regular grilled cheese, like, sandwiches that you can do. Or you can mix and match with the sides. And they have great sides. Like, we tried the macaroni and cheese, which was pretty good. So it got a nice little spice to it. And then we tried the tomato soup, which for me, I don't even like tomato soup. But this tomato soup was, like, delicious. And it was an actual tomato and basil. And I think I picked up a couple few more ingredients, but hey. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> um, and then we tried the tater tots, which the tater tots are your run-in-the-mill tater tots, but it's the sauces that come with tater tots that are what sells them. Um, we actually got, what is it, the, I have to refer to my little list here. Oh, where are the dipping sauces on the menu? I don't even know. Uh, then we got the garlic aioli and the sauce called I'm Sorry Sauce, which... I am so sorry I tried that sauce. I literally dipped my tater tot in like the minuscule amount of sauce because she told us how hot this sauce was. And my mouth was instantly on fire. My sister like took a big ass dip in it and she had to actually go buy milk at the liquor store that we were parked in front of so she can like cool her mouth off and I didn't even really cut the cut the edge. So it's serious, like, it's serious spice. I think there's probably, like, habanero and a little bit of ghost chili in there for sure because it's fucking it's ridiculous. Um, but, yeah, so anyways, if you're in the L.A. area, you should totally check out the grilled cheese truck. And I decided that what I'll do is I'll create a little food vlog truck series and, like, street meat truck vendor series and you know, take you guys on my little food truck adventures throughout LA. So stay tuned for that. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you guys are having a great weekend and stay warm for those of you who are in the cold and stay out this crazy wind. It's been crazy windy. There's a tree knocked down like right at the street light by my, on my corner from the wind. It's bananas. But anyways, stay safe, stay warm and everybody enjoy your weekend and thanks for watching.